I'm Michael Taylor Gray with Serial Scoop Now. Say it with me. Serial Scoop, Scoop now. now. And I am woman. Hear me pee. Yeah. Did I say that right? Yes, you did. Yeah. Because like, pee makes a specific sound. It has it an aura to it. Yeah. 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 And that helps you do what last year? It helped me do what last year? Yeah. Um, I won. <laughs> I told you I smelled winners here. And the first person we talked to is a winner. Introduce us to, introduce us to your audience. Introduce yourself to the audience and just tell them how fabulous you are and just how you got here this evening. So my name's Melissa Archer and I'm really fabulous. Yeah, write that down. Write this is down. not just a yearbook little moment. If this is an everyday know, occurrence. We're telling you. Yeah, we're telling you. Yeah. You will be told. You will be told. You will be told. Right now, now, what are you doing this evening besides being a winner uh, before? Uh, no. And I have to tell you, just I'm a free race winner too. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we're, it's all about coming together. It is. As winners. As winners. As winners. As so what are you doing this evening? Uh, I am presenting. Best you certainly are. Um, yeah. Is she presenting or what? I'm presenting. Yeah. Best lead actor in a comedy and best lead actress in a drama. In a drama. Mm -hmm. Now, what do you prefer to do, comedy or drama? I actually love them both equally. <sighs> Like I your know. children. I, know. I can't pick a favorite. But you know, there really is one that you like a little better. I mean What do you think is what do you think is your when when you're in your wheelhouse as an actor? Well, I did drama for so long that yeah. I feel like it's pretty easy to get in touch with, but yeah. comedy is more challenging, which is more it fun. It is harder, yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah. And so why do you think like with the Academy Awards that comedy gets overlooked, but not here at the Indie Series Awards? Uh, that's right. Um, you know, I don't know. I can don't you do know. some research on that for me? I'll get do back some to me? research, yeah. Okay. I'm really good at research. I can tell. Um, Google tell. fanatic here. Hey, hey. Search, Google search fanatic See? specifically. Smart. No being here. Actor, winner, and presenting. Lovely. Would you give us a nice little twirl here? Oh. Look at that. Look, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Oh. You're right. I tell you, who needs a buffet table when you have this? Right? <laughs> you look right. great. Thank Hugs. you. Great to see you. We're, le we're lemmings. We're here with, with uh, five nominations. Five? Wow. Yeah. For what, what, what are your nominations? Well, we got Best Lead Actor over here. Your name? Shawn Michael Bowles. Wow. He has to have three names, kids. He's special. <laughs> uh, best guest star right here. What? Dan Stern. Oh, nice guest to have in your house, right? Why, thank you. Yeah, because you'll be watching this series at home, I'm assuming. So, and you? Uh, I, I'm Matthew Kreiner. Yeah. I got uh, best editing. We have also best writing and best dramatic web series. You guys aren't busy enough. So, which season is this for you guys? Uh, this is our first season. This is our inaugural season. We have a, we have several first season uh, shows here that are uh, that are coming here to be nominated. You guys came all the way from New York. New York. We have Brooklyn in the house. New York, Manhattan. Manhattan. I'm Queens. Oh, you can't have New York without Queens, kids. That you know that, true. right? Okay. <laughs> well, good luck tonight. And as I've been telling everybody, storm the stage, uh -huh. and yell fixed, fixed if you don't win. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. And you d oh, yell La La Land. It'll work. It's, it's the go-to. What are you nominated for? Uh, I'm nominated for Best Actress for... Of course. Thanks. For um, Plant the Second Coming, written by these guys. Oh, oh I've seen it. You guys are fabulous. Comedy. Oh, yeah, comedy. Sorry. Very that. funny. She's a very funny lady. Thank Invite you. her over for dinner. Okay. You'll, you'll, you'll choke on your you chili. you fly me out there, look. Great. Okay. First of all, Jesus chili. Yeah, thank you, G. With, with grated cheeses. Yes. Yeah, grated ah. cheeses. Yes. And you are? I'm Andrew Nielsen. Yeah, I'm the creator and uh, director. Yeah, yeah. We all believe in the great creator. Yep. It's no accident. No accident. And look it. at that great tie. Well, that's what we do. That's what we do. <laughs> and I'm David Levine. I'm the co-writer. And a great smile, this guy. Look at it. Lights up the room. We needed that. So, now, like I've told my other guests, if you don't win, storm the stage and just say, uh, why do you hate Jesus? Why do you hate Jesus? <laughs> Yeah, okay, do that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. God. That's why? a good. Yeah. Why? Yeah. Okay. And just crawl to your knees and just do these. Do this a lot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And blood tears. Blood tears. <laughs> I know. I know. I'm. I'm going for the gusto. I'm born and raised Japan. Military kid. I saw it. I saw you it coming. Saw it. My dad Media. was in the Air Force. Really? So, yeah. Yeah. Thank you for yeah. your service. I wasn't born in Japan. No. Okay. That's fine. I was born in Montana. Okay. Not quite Japan. You still saw something. You saw yeah. a mountain or two. Yeah. I guess so. Yeah. Whatever. So tell us what <laughs> whatever's right. So what are you doing here? Why are you here? Did you just show up? Were you shopping just, to the Costco around the corner? Ex exactly. I was I was here. I saw a churro and I was like, hey, uh -huh. I want to go get a good churro. Right. So we're going to Costco. Mm -hmm. No, um, I got nominated here for best original song. My show called My So Called Co-Star Life is about a guy named Real Will Smith, who's not the real Will Smith, 
and he has to live in Los Angeles and go through all the problems of not being black enough and talented enough in the industry. Wait a minute, that's a problem here? Uh, maybe, what? Maybe. Really? It might be a problem. It might not be. I've you never, never heard know, of that. Depending really? on who you are. Yeah. So you know. now, you obviously, you're trying to tell us something. You're trying to to express uh, a viewpoint here. Yes. So how does this give you that opportunity to do it? How is it unique for you to do that? Well, it's unique because it's my voice telling... It's a nice voice, kids. Thank you. It's, it's, a, it, uh, it's my voice saying it in a way of how I grew up. You know, I'm using a specific name, yes, but I'm using my story, my voice of where I came from, and not knowing much about the industry and how I was guided myself in the industry, you know? And it, it, it's opened up a lot of different doors for me because it's been so different. Is this your first season? This is my first season, but I do come from a web series background. I uh, first started in a series called Prom Queen with Michael Eisner back in the day. And um, The Michael Eisner? The Michael Eisner from Disney. And I started on that show called Prom Queen, and um, it got nominated for an Emmy back in the day, and then I, I started producing and, and directing ever since. What's the most surprising aspect of uh, doing your own series? What, what has sort of opened your eyes about uh, being personally involved at this level in the web series community? Um, you it's have a very to, serious question, yeah, kids. Sometimes we have to take it down a lot, you got, you get real serious. Gotta, Let's get real. You got to ask the serious guys the serious questions. Yeah, yeah. I get it. Um, it definitely, it definitely um, made me more hardworking and relentless uh -huh. and wanting this, this business more and knowing that it is a business. Not also a show, but it is a business. And you have to treat it as such. You know, so. Mm -hmm. Well, it looks like you're treating it well, and it's treating you well. Well, I, 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 so. I can't complain. I'm always happy. I'm, I'm always smiling. I got a beautiful date with me, Katie Stegman. Right. Oh, uh, a beautiful filmmaker. Smart man here. Great, smart. great talented yeah. woman. You surround, you surround yourself with great talent. You have it to. lifts you up. Hi, I'm Leo with People Like Us, and this is Josh Crow, uh, a lead actor in the series. So, Any nominations tonight we should know about? Yeah, yes. we've got five nominations. Five? Yep. Wow, you guys must be very good. <laughs> what are these nominations? We have Best, best drama, drama Series, Best Directing, uh, Editing, Cinematography, and, and Best Supporting, supporting actor. actor for Drama. Very, very nice. Now, um, if you don't win, I, I, I'm telling everybody, storm the stage. If you do win, you've got to cry the big, ugly Oprah cry. <laughs> Okay. Well, knowing me, tug at our heartstrings. Might. Well, I might. I'm the might emotional cry. one, so I'll probably yeah. cry. Yeah. Do, are you wearing waterproof uh, mascara tonight? Because you don't want it to I'm run. Pretty sure I am. Yes. Yeah. See, always, always make sure. Always make sure. Yeah, yeah. And have a makeup artist in the back. Oh, to, great. To, you know, for, okay. Yeah. We'll, we'll take care of you. We'll take care of you. Yeah. So, do you have a speech prepared? Uh, no speech, but I'm presenting tonight, so I've prepared that. He is presenting. Will you turn around and show us? Sure. Look how cute. Look at this. Very nice. Who are you wearing? Uh, it's tailored. I have a good friend that's a designer. He's coming in or up and coming. So, very mysterious. <laughs> look it up. Look it up. Look, well, good luck tonight, guys. Thank you. you know, you. cause a stir. Say something saucy and racy. Oh, I you know. Right on stage naked or something. I wasn't going to suggest that, <laughs> but I was really. I was. Really, I'm glad you say that. So yeah, absolutely. Okay. You know, I don't think anybody would complain. This, this is rippable. Yeah. I like them. You may not see these guys again. Yeah, we're going to be doing our own show, but it'll be on a different channel. Okay. Todd Flaherty, I'm with Undetectable. Uh, um, I, I, I didn't quite know you were there. You were Undetectable. Yeah, well, yeah, so tell us, what do you do with the show? Well, uh, well I wrote the show, um, and I also am the lead actor in the show, so we're nominated. Wait a minute. Yeah, Creating your own opportunity in the web series world? It's crazy. It's crazy. Who would have thought you know, to I do that? Was like, one day I was like, you know what? I'm going to try something different mm -hmm. and uh, see where it takes me. Yeah. And here we are tonight. Yeah, don't sit there and wait for your agent or your manager or your mom or your dad or the neighbor mm -hmm. yeah, to do something for you. Gonna all Create take it yourself. Same thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So how's it going? Is this your yeah. first season? This is our first season. We only have three Again, episodes. Again, guys, and, uh, first first season. Yeah, seven nominations tonight. So seven. Oh, exciting. that's one of the leading contenders. Hey, I, yeah, I, I've yeah, heard yeah. five. I've heard six. First time I've heard seven tonight. So. All right. I think there are some with like a bucket load more. So we're like, you know. Really, we're, we're, we're show offs. About seven. Seven's a good yeah. number. It's a good number. Yeah. 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 Now, uh, my suggestion is, I've told people, yes. if by chance, and I'm not suggesting that you won't win, mm -hmm. but if just yell, just get up, storm the stage. Scream. Storm the stage. Yeah. Yeah. Pull like an Oscars yeah, yeah, yeah. moment where yeah, I like, exactly. have my own card. And yeah. I'm like, no, 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 no. no, no I've got it right here. 
It's yeah, right here. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't know how well that'll go over. I, I, I'm not you know, from I'm all LA. I'm from New York, so I'm right? on a plane oh, the next day oh, anyway, honey. and like no one will bother me. New York, me, yeah. you're like, yeah. you know, so what, what, what are you stupid? Oh, well, Come yeah. on, yeah, yeah. So good luck. <laughs> so you. handsome. Look at it. Look at it. Thank you. You know, thank you. Talking about your jacket, but I. It's from Miss America. It's from a Miss America wardrobe. We've got look. We got a statement here. A statement here. Uh, it's something different. Is it your hair? What? Is it your hair? I mean, uh, I'm just, what is, what's going on? Oh, uh, oh, it's the glasses. Oh, oh. 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 So tell, what's going on here? Who are you? <laughs> so I'm Karen. What are you wearing? Career. This is Marzi Hart. I'm Marzi Hart. I created a show called Working on It, for which she's nominated for Best Costume Design. She's working on working on it. She's working yeah. on it. Working costume on it. Costume design. On it. Yes, did sir. you do? Did you design the glasses? I did. I had a feeling, kids. Yeah, because we had a costume designer here. We won't say who it was on another show, wearing clothes from a friend on a show with a about a detective who doesn't wear pants. I'm like, <laughs> how does that work for you as a costume designer? She also made this outfit. Look, yes. look at. Oh, wow. Oh, hello. That's good. Wow. So how many nominations tonight? Uh, one. One she the show. is the She is the show. So you get up there, regardless of whatever name comes out, I hope it's yours. I'm just saying right now. Thank you. But if it's not, go up on stage anyway. Yes. Go up on stage. It's here, a community. Meeting everybody. It's so exciting. Yeah. It's so fun. Like, so, uh, now, you came all the way from? New York. I, I haven't met anybody from Los Angeles yet. I love it. We should we should go back to New York and do the show. Roger comes all the way over here. I know, right? What's up with that? But, you know, I love my, my L.A. But, uh, well, have a wonderful time. You both look fantastic. You know, you have a look. I love it. Yeah. I mean, I borrowed this. Mr. Anthony Anderson. Oh, who was a guest on Pretty many moons yes, ago. Yes, I was. But now he's got... You got Anacostia, the show, the show that, oh my God, you just got, how many seasons have you guys got going now? Five seasons so far, 44 episodes, will be 50 by the end of June, so. Oh, I was yeah. 50 by the end of June last year. <laughs> yeah, so that's ironic. Yeah, about 50, yeah, about 50 episodes, which is amazing, look back on everything. I remember when you were just a little baby show. Yeah, just a, 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 a well, 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 in a lot of ways, I think we're still just a little baby show. Like, I still look at it as, still in its infancy mm -hmm. like 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 despite as many people say the success that we've had um we don't really look at that we look at how can we continue oh you don't look no, at your success no we don't <laughs> no it's you like, just being humble no it's, no seriously I'm, I'm 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 still sort of taking in from last week emmy nomination so mm -hmm. um emmy nominated so yeah. it's stuff like that is the perks of doing something that you love and that's the thing like if you do something that you love sometimes you get the perks but even if you don't get the perks you still have the thing that you love i've seen you grow up in this community Th thank you thank you i feel I, like my baby's all grown you're gonna make me, you're gonna make me start crying because it has uh, been he's a crier i love it, it me too it's been since 2009 mm -hmm. and you've been there and yeah. myself and gregory and um some of the other ones so it it's a lot to come back tonight after eight years from the, fir mm -hmm. the first one yeah. and still sort of be in the game yeah. and, and, and you know it like it doesn't as Martha would say it doesn't suck that's good on occasion that's a good thing <laughs> yeah I'm just saying now uh, why would you think that kids keep it clean keep it clean keep it clean that's right now see this is a, you're our testament of just you know the tenacity of in the spirit of the web series community about creating your own work creating your own opportunities and and giving other people opportunities as well and inspiring Absolutely. other people to Absolutely. create their own work and I, I and I think the thing is that I would give out to any creator because I because I've heard from a lot of creators of color say that they just feel like um, what's the point of them doing their shows because they don't get recognized or they don't get coverage or or no one knows that they're out there it shouldn't be about that it shouldn't be about that it should be about your vision it should be about your dream it should be about the passion it should always be about that so when you start talking about stuff like that you're in it for the wrong reasons and you're bound to fail when we started this show none of this I didn't know anything about any of this. So none of this existed. I did it because there was a love for the show. And I say to all the independent producers out there that don't have that much money, that don't think that they can get it done, you can get it done. You just have to have a passion and an ambition behind yourself. Do you have a story to tell? 
discover your voice. Discover your and I voice. think that this, this process has really helped you discover your own voice. Absolutely. Um, especially with this last season, we've dealt with some really serious topics, some really serious issues that um, are needed in not only in our community, but it just needs to create a community dialogue mm -hmm. about, male, about male rape mm -hmm. and how male rape is not reported or how it's scrutinized by law, law enforcement. So um, I think that we're doing some great stuff. I think everyone here is doing some great stuff, and that's why we're still here. That's why I love coming to see you, always dapper. Uh huh. Wearing, always wearing, dapper. wearing a piece from Miss America's wardrobe. Well, yeah. So we got well, more to talk about. Yeah. So, As I tell all my guests, get out, get out, Anthony.